Hi, I'm Teacher Julie, and welcome back for some more reading practice. Today, we are going to continue reading about furniture and prices. And we want to read some comparative. Cheaper, more expensive. Taller, shorter, new, old. We want to practice using the words and reading the words that we've been introduced to this week. So here is our reading practice. Tomorrow, your assessment will have 10 questions. They will look like these. Please know that some questions have two or three good answers. Okay, sometimes there is one good answer. Some questions, there are two good answers. And sometimes there are three good answers. So please read the whole question before you answer. Let's begin. On this exercise, I want you to read. I will be quiet. Okay, you'll need to stop the video to read. So here we are, first question. Stop the video and read. The sofa is two thousand two hundred and ninety nine dollars. Please read. Stop your video. The sofa is new, yes. The sofa is expensive. The sofa is brown. Here, there are three good answers. Please read. The chair is $149. The answer is C. Please read. A, $39.99. The kitchen table is $39.99. Please read. C. The fridge is $2,699. Please read. The floor lamp is more expensive than the table lamp. More expensive. The answer is B. Please read. The more expensive pot is C. The blue pot. Please read. Remember to stop the video if you read slowly. The cheaper item is the container. The container. Did you remember the word container and jar? This one is a jar. The jar costs $8.99. The jar is more expensive. The container 
is $3.99. The container is cheaper. Please read. Stop the video to read. Cheaper is small money. The mattress that cost $179 is cheaper. But my answers do not have money. My answers, spring mattress twin, the black bed, spring mattress queen, and the lamp. If I look near the price, of the cheaper mattress, I see spring mattress twin. So A is my answer. The spring mattress twin is $179 and the spring mat mattress twin is cheaper. Please read. The more expensive chair is D, the blue chair, the blue chair. The blue chair is $159. The blue chair is more expensive than the white chair. The answer is D, the blue chair. Please read. The question is, what is the same? What do both wardrobes have? A, both wardrobes have mirrors. Yes, they do. Both wardrobes are white. No, they are not white, they are black. C, both wardrobes are $199. Yes, that is also a good answer. This question has two good answers. Both wardrobes, both means two. The two wardrobes have mirrors and the same price. Each wardrobe, one, two, costs $199. So the mirrors are the same. The price, the money is the same. There are two good answers, A and C. Please read. What is cheaper? C, the picture is cheaper. The picture is $16.99. $16.99 is smaller. It's less money than the mirror. The mirror is $69.99. That's more. The answer is C. The picture is cheaper. Please read. <laughs> the answer is we're on this one. <laughs> How much is the table and chairs? How much, it should say are the table and chairs. Table and chairs is two things, plural. How much are the table and chairs? I can read the table and four chairs are $149. I circle, this is a coffee table. It does not have chairs, so it is not the right answer. C, please read. The white mug is $1.99 and it's cheaper. It's cheaper. There are two good
good answers for this question. How much is the white mug? Well, it's a dollar ninety nine and it's cheaper. Two good answers. Please read. And the answer is here for you again. Oh. I check and check and do not see the mistakes. <laughs> ah. Okay, let's go here. Try this one. What is more expensive? The answer is C. The table is more expensive. The table is more expensive. Please read. What is taller? B, the bookshelf is taller. The bookshelf is taller. Please read. The answer is B. The chair is $179. What is cheaper? See, the curtains are cheaper than the rug. I have to look here to see that $89 is the price of the rug, the rug. The answer is C, the curtains are cheaper than the rug. Please read. That is wrong. It's not thirty nine ninety nine. That is the curtain. The rug is eighty nine dollars. C is the answer. And I can oh ah. um uh oh uh oh what's happening? I wanted to fix that for you quickly. This one. Um, how much is the rug, right? It's $89 there. That's better. So let's go back. Try again. How much is the rug? The rug is $89. The answer is C, $89. Let's try. <gasps> Please read. What is the answer? The wall shelf is under the sink, next to the sink, above the sink. The answer is C, above the sink. Please read. The hmm are on the sofa. Pillows. The pillows are on the sofa. Something else I can look at is my verb are. Are means plural. Pillows is plural. Floor lamp, not plural. This is not a good answer. Picture, not plural, not a good answer. Also, the floor lamp is behind the sofa. The picture is above the sofa. The pillows, plural, 
and they are on the sofa. A is a very good answer. Please read. The plant is on the floor and beside the sofa. There are two good answers, two good answers. The plant is on the floor and beside or next to the sofa. So that's our practice for today. Uh, please go back, watch the video again. You can press mute so you do not hear me. Uh, do the reading, practice the reading, practice the questions. And remember, some questions have two or three good answers. Read all the answers and then choose the good answers. Okay, so that's all for now. I hope you have a good practice and I'll see you tomorrow for your assessment. Bye-bye.